Amen. <laughs> Amen. Amen. Yes, Lord. So, now, Queese, I need you to tell the people where, what what brought you to gospel music? Tell us about Queese and where you, where, where you got your foundation. Gotcha. First off, though, I got to say happy birthday to you. Thank you. I appreciate <laughs> it. Thank you so much. Thank you. Man, it is like so it's... good to cherish life. But yeah, what I started when it came to gospel, um, I was born coming into this thing with God and different things like that. But I didn't know that God had me on that fast track system. You will listen. And the reason why I say that because I had a mature fast, you know, um, being a type one diabetic. Mm. Um, I've been one for 27 years oh, wow. and also losing my mom mm. at the age of um, 15 years old. Mm. I had to grow up fast. Yes. You know what I'm saying? So um, in that time span, I um, developed a relationship with God on my own. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Not riding off of my mama coattail or my Come dad on. coattail. I had to know God for myself. Exactly. I didn't know what the journey had entailed for me. Mm -hmm. So even mm -hmm. though my life changed with diabetes, it changed a lot when I mm -hmm. lost her. So I had to begin to like really cry out to God for myself and different things like that. Mm -hmm. So I came to grips with singing and with singing, it became a whole nother universe. Absolutely. So when I feel down, when I go into depression mm -hmm. or when I feel anger or mm -hmm. when I was dealing with bitterness, Mm -hmm. Music was that place. So turning on that Donna McClurkin song stand or turning on Kimbo Rail yes. or turning on those other great songs that yes. caused me to get over, yes. you know what I'm saying? Yes. Or those old school songs like my soul, yeah. love, yeah. Jesus, them type of songs right there yeah. that helped me get over. So, mm. you know what I'm saying? That's where yes. my roots came from. Yes, And indeed. from there, that's where God started growing me and maturing me. Yes, indeed. So, that's where my heart, my love came with gospel music. Yes. And as I got older, I started to get into that neo soul vibe and here and there when it came <laughs> yes. to college and whatnot. Yeah. You got Jill Scott over here. You got uh, 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 Louis Armstrong, it... all them greats. Come on now. So, it's like I, I fell in love with music. I love yeah. it. So gospel and that neo soul mixed together, I love it. So I tell people, when I come and sing, I'm coming to you with a soulful sound from the heart. Exactly. It's that teaches, mm -hmm. that expresses God's word, uh -huh. and you can also hear something smooth to the ears. Come on now, see? And that's <laughs> what I tell people is we have to live in the authentic and not the falsetto. Yes. And so... Yes. The reason is because when we were handcrafted, the word says that he knew us before we were formed in the womb. That's he right. The he already knew head. you. So mm -hmm. if he sent, and he, the Jeremiah 29 and 11 said, I know the plans for you to yeah. have a future and a hope, to prosper and not to mm -hmm. harm. So right. if his plan was, hey, I need Quees to give his sauce on this because what he does is not what Monique does because Monique does R&B, soul, neo soul, jazz as well. Yeah. In my music style. But yeah. what they need from him, they need to hear a man that knows about God for himself. Right. They need to hear a woman right. that knows about God for herself. And right. the, the trials that we've been through come out in our testimony. And mm -hmm. it's I tell people all the time, you can't catch catfish with bass bait. <laughs> That's a good one. <laughs> you know, take that to the bank and cash that. You see what I'm saying? <laughs> so, mm -hmm. like, when when they see, wait a minute, Queston lost his mom, and he, he yet praising. Monique then lost her husband at thirty. Yeah, she became a widow a couple of months after her grandmother's. Why she helping them deal? Now she got to heal. <laughs> Wow. Queese is there dealing with the loss of his mother and helping his father deal and his health and his, you know, that looks like my story. Mm -hmm. But look at God. Look at God. Look what he did. Cause that's tough. No matter what age you are, no matter it, it, it's, it's hard to deal with a loved one leaving. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Because with that, you got to know how to maneuver through that. You got to have them strong supporters, them people praying in a corner for you. Absolutely. Because I know when I was going through, 
bitterness came. Yeah. Depression came. Absolutely. Anger came on a whole different level that I've never experienced. Even though I was going to church, mm -hmm. even though I was singing on a praise team, come on, I was fighting. Listen, I left fighting. everything. I wow. literally left everything. When my husband died, it was March 5th. We buried yes. him on the 11th. And on April 1st, I was driving truck cross country for a year. Ooh. I literally put everything. I took the cable out of my name. I took my name off the lease. I said, y'all figure it out to my roommates. Mm -hmm. I'm out of here. Deuces got to go. <laughs> because I needed to get somewhere to get my right. mind right. Because I know if I stay here, y'all mm -hmm. drink and y'all smoke weed. And that can't be my remedy. Because mm -hmm. I got other stuff to do. And right, I can't right. drown myself. I can't drink this pain away. I can't smoke this pain away. I can't sex this pain away. I have to deal with it, heal it, so that I can grow and go into what's next for me in my life. And you said something strong right there, dealing with it. You know what I mean? So many times people would think that drinking, smoking, sex is the way to go. But it's just a temporary fix. It's like a Band-Aid putting on the womb. After a while, that Band-Aid get worn out. Exactly. After a while, and you got to change that thing. So sometimes exactly. you got to go through that thing. And the mm. thing that I had to understand down the years, you know what I'm saying? And um, that that happened at 15 years old. I'm mm. 31 now. So See? I had to learn sometimes God will allow you to go through because he sees strength in you that you're going to carry out that thing. Absolutely. So it's like, God, even though I was the victim of that, mm. even though I had to go through that and I didn't want to, even mm -hmm. though you had to go through that and deal mm -hmm. with the pain, mm -hmm. now you are a testimony. Now you are, uh, uh, you can carry the victory to somebody else to say, hey, I am enduring through this. I'm a survivor through this. Exactly. So don't and you, you dare can too. give up. Come on now. That's right. Don't you dare give in mm -hmm. because God will carry you through that thing yes, all the way. Yes, indeed. Come on. Hallelujah. All the way. Hallelujah. That's what I'm talking about. And the thing is, some people don't know that they can trust him. And so in seeing us go through, then they say, wait a minute. I ain't picked up yeah. a Bible, but I see it walking right there. Right. Living witnesses. Let me let me, let me me check out this book and see what she's talking about. Let me check out this right. book and see what he's talking about in them lyrics. Okay. Okay. So we are going to roll right into this amazing music by this young man, Queeks. Taylor made on the Gospel Drip on VTV Television and the Coyote Man Show Network. Check it out. Let it sizzle in your spirit and bless your playlist. Amen. Amen. I just don't understand, but Lord, I trust you. People come and go just like the wind blows, but Lord, I trust Cause Jesus guides my way Lord, I trust you I may not ever see An hour of another day Or even don't know why Things don't go my way trust you 
I'm gonna trust you. Oh, I don't have fortune or fame, but Jesus knows my name. Lord, I trust you. Yes, I do. No diamonds, pearls, or gold. Cause Jesus is whom I hold. Lord, I trust you. No matter where I go, you're the perfect gift I know. Lord, I trust Yes, I do. I may not ever see an hour of another day, or even don't know why things don't go my way. I may not plainly see how you may. I'm gonna trust you I may not ever see an hour of another day or even don't know why things don't go my way I may not realize you made a way, but Lord, I trust you. I'm gonna trust you. I will trust you. Mm. My Lord, my Lord, I will trust you. And that's the thing is, 